Wednesday. We've just had a, a beautiful meal at the Marjolaine just up the road uh, in Moulay, um, right next to Mayenne town. Uh, wine, rump steak, fragois. Oh, delicious. I'm full, a bit bloaty, but things have to be done. It's now three o'clock quarter past I can't see my watch actually uh, so I've got I'm gonna do this tree here because I've done the rest up there I'm gonna try and do at least one tree and then uh, see how it goes and if I feel energetic enough to do another tree I will do that so tools for the trade are a bag of bark bin bags heavy duty Water, gloves, rake, shovel, fork, speaker for the sounds. And I should be cracking on, considering it's not raining. So, I'm not going to film it, because it's just me doing weeding. So, uh, I'll come back to you. Speak to you in a minute. That was hard work, especially after a stomach uh, full of... Uh, nice food and a few wine, uh, glasses of wine anyway that one done this one done so i've done all the trees bar the one over there and these two here i'm wiped out now though i think i'll need a, a cup of tea or something and a lie down <laughs> Let's see what tomorrow brings, shall we? Uh, anyway, catch you later. Thursday. Uh, this uh, this morning, um, I was at the hospital um, having my scheduled blood test. Nice and simple. Uh, felt it felt like they took at, at least a liter, <laughs> but. Uh, it was five vials of blood and um, so I should get the results uh, the same day failing that tomorrow morning uh, if there are any anomalies that was good and uh, yeah and uh, the, come back today and do a bit of gardening that type of thing and uh, check in on our little Una she's starting to get back to normal but she's still a bit subdued. Um, so I don't quite know what's going on there. It's worrying. Because we have to have the discussion whether... Well, she has a skin condition. So if the skin condition does not improve, then it's the Handishan uh, Association will not take her. Um because she, she should be classed as too much maintenance. Um, so yeah, uh, we have to have that discussion whether we want to keep her, if it comes to it. So that's where we are. Oh, I, I also had my tetanus jab this morning um, at the uh, chemist, believe it or not. Go in with your paperwork, bang, 10 minutes later, you're all tetanatized. <laughs> How cool is that? Um, so th things, uh, when they go well in France, they're really good. They're, the hospitals and their equivalent of the NHS is absolutely spot on. You can't fault it whatsoever. So, yeah, I, I, I'm, I'm quite happy about that. See, I'm, I'm, I'm mumb not mumbling, I'm babbling. Um... So I, I'm going to do some strimming at the bottom of the orchard because it needs it. And um, I may film it from the tractor. Let's wait and see. See you in a minute.
Excuse me, can I be quieter? Yeah, right. Just a little bit today, because I'm very fatigued. I've had so many pricks today, it's beyond belief. I mean, needle pricks. Anyway, I think that's me for today. I'll catch you tomorrow. Well, the wife and the mother-in-law stopped me carrying on um, because I was too noisy. But at the end of the day, work needs to be done. I know it's mother-in-law's last day. She's leaving us tomorrow. And it's not been a bad week, actually. Fixed her computer. Uh, told her what not to do and what to do. Um, it was an easy fix, to be honest. Um, uh, Avast was playing up and she'd obviously click something on uh, Google Chrome, which gave her an audible warning saying, you have to call this number. So I got rid of that, cleaned the computer, uh, did all the updates, uh, disabled Avast, got rid of it and um, advised her on what to do because Windows security is, is ample but she clicks on everything. Oldies, I tell you what, the ads nowadays and the spam you get on emails, uh, it's, it's, um, it's aimed at the very young and the very old. Um, the people who don't know any better and uh, there should be a charge to any spam that goes into anyone's inbox honestly something's got to be done about it but anyway I'm, 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 I'm whinging uh, so today that's it that's me wiped out I'm, um, it's, it's quite muggy it's about 24 23 24 degrees but it's muggy it's weird really weird Hopefully it'll be a bit fresher tomorrow and we can crack on with some gardening. Anyway, let's wait until tomorrow. Catch you later. Saturday. Lost all days of the week this week because of the mother-in-law. Uh, my blood tests uh, were emailed to me uh, yesterday. Um, I can't believe how quick that was. So they email the results to you and also your doctor gets a copy of your results and uh, obviously it's in French so I had the wife there translating everything and um, looking at it straight in the middle everything with intolerance uh, which I was quite over the moon with um, even my iron levels which um, my family may worry uh, about to iron levels so I try to be tested on iron um, every couple of years type of thing but I haven't been tested for four years so uh, because of uh, uh, hereditary hemochromatosis in the family so worry over blood test perfect absolutely spot on um, and yesterday what did we do yesterday it was just a kickback do some shopping, uh, um, do some training on Una because she's she's changed personality, and um, uh, just type some loose ends. Uh, make sure her mother got off okay. Uh, she got back okay. That's all good. And today I've just been uh, weeding and uh, spraying with um, vinegar solution special mix um it's like a gallon of vinegar or thereabouts four liters of vinegar a cup of salt uh a teaspoon of citric acid and a splash of washing up liquid in a can let uh, the salt and uh, citric acid dissolve and then uh, spray it where it's needed uh on, on tarmac and concrete more than anything um and that's what I've been doing. Um, I did some the other day, yesterday actually, and the results are astounding. Um, because vinegar, you, you can buy it uh, in in any shop in, in France. It's readily available uh, and people use it as, as weed killer. 
and it, it's really good really good so uh yeah it's been a, a restful week i've still got one more tree to do we've got uh got the bark so it's just that last tree a uh, bit of strimming yesterday but i've got stopped because i'm too noisy from the wife um so that's it um i'll give an update later well that's another day successful day of weeding in temperatures of 28 degrees centigrade it's not bad is it so this bed here is now fully completed not bad I, I, I think it looks great I think it looks really good I don't mind if I say so myself all the lawns mowed I've still got that elusive, elusive tree to do the orchards are done as well just that tree the far tree at the end I've just got to do that one all the others all the others are done Just waiting for the farmer to put his cows in the field now. Because that's what he does. Uh, field down here. Down to our little pool. There's our little pool. There's a slide here. Whoever used it before was, well, yeah, must have been very young. I don't think I'll get my fat ass in it. I might have a go though, just for a bit of fun. Because the sun's low, you might not be able to see. All this overgrow, all this overgrown paddock area and the field below it is ours. And uh, what the farmer normally does, he, uh, I normally see him anyway. Um, we give a, a thumbs up to each other and he uh, puts his cows in. He uses next door's field as well. What a beautiful day. What an absolute beautiful day. I've got to clean the pool out. Got bits of debris in it. <clears throat> I think uh, the missus has got a dry suit, so. Let's walk up this side. It is a glorious evening. There's our olive tree. Our sole olive tree. This tree, I've mentioned it before, it's called a prehistoric tree. Very rare. Very rare indeed. Um, I think it's called a prehistoric tree. Don't, I mean, don't quote me. I think it's called a prehistoric tree because they were in, they were there in prehistoric times. This is our pear tree. Just got to tidy up the the bottom bit. It's looking a lot healthier than it did last year. I tell you that. Uh, Asian Hornet Trap, courtesy of AJ in France. Thank you very much. We've had no Hornets. And they're dotted around, these traps are dotted around everywhere. Because we had a, as you know, if you follow me, we had a Hornet's uh, nest last year. Magnolia tree. Don't see the point of them. All I give you is this it's not fit for use you can't eat it it flowers nice that's about it but it's just a beer moth and it creates debris everywhere it ruins my lawn escapades 
and that's uh, that's it for today I do apologize if the content isn't there for you on this vlog it's a culmination of days that's all I'm still lumming and ahhing whether to keep doing these vlogs because there's, there's, there's one user that comments on all of my videos and I love the comments and I always reply and um, that user knows who they are um, and I do appreciate the comments so that's where we are and it's uh, what time is it it's uh, five to seven in the evening and I think I'm going to have a mojito and why the devil not the missus has just gone to walk Una so time for a shower and uh, get ready for bed no I'm only joking anyway I'll catch you later. Thanks for watching. Bye now. Sunday. I've just uh, sprayed some vinegar mixture uh, on our driveway. And because uh, there's hardly any wind this morning. Still a beautiful day. Uh, hopefully it'll knock the weeds out and I think today me and the wife are going to empty this barrel it's a, a barrel a cart it's a herb cart we don't want it here so we're going to empty it and relocate it close to the house um, because I want to reclaim this this lawn. I don't know what's under there actually. Oh, just dirt. Is it just dirt? Yeah. So that's what we're going to do. So we've got in here chives. Um, that one's citronella type stuff. Ooh. Lemony. Uh, I don't know what you call that. That's the same, I think. Oh, that's the common variety weed. Oh, and that's a weed as well. We did have parsley in here somewhere. Oh, that's pars. Oh, that's flat leaf parsley. This is sage, or was sage, sh 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 sage, and what's that? That is mint, so that can go, because we've got tons of it. All this here is mint. Have you seen our rhubarb patch? Look at that. Okay, we've got weeds here surrounding the rhubarb and the mint over there. But that, I cleared the path yesterday, so it's all work in progress. So, just waiting for the wife to get her act into gear, and then I've got to stop filming, I'm afraid, because she does not want to be on YouTube. She, sh she should have told me that when I first started it. But uh, it is what it is. It's going to get cooler in the week. What have we got for lunch today? We've got steak with roast potatoes and flageole beans. I'm looking, really looking forward to that. So uh, anyway, I'll uh, give you an update when I've got one. Catch you later. Well, that was a good morning's work, that. Um, being a Sunday, can't really do a lot. 
um, noise-wise. But, like I said before, path cleared. And, the herb cart is gone. All I've got to do is put some seed down, weed it, and then I can, this will be a nice little lawn. That was hard work though, really hard work, because we had to, had to empty it, get rid, uh, de-weed it, sort out the good herbs from the bad, empty the soil, then, because it's all cast iron, then drag it out. Fortunately, everything rotated. And then um, move it down. I'll show you in a minute. Down there, it's down there. One thing I will say, uh, if you want non-toxic weed killer, is definitely go for the vinegar option. Uh, you want it extra concentrated though. And it, it literally, this I, I sprayed this yesterday. I sprayed this today. All the brown bits, it's killed it. This I sprayed today. It's just killed it. So I would recommend it. You can find out the recipe on the internet. It's 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 good, really good. Just run out of it. It's relatively cheap. Was it five euros a four liter container? So now I'm walking down to where we moved the uh, cart. And here it is. Yes, it was heavy. So. Oh, she's done it all in French. So, in theory, in theory, We've got a herb garden right outside the front door. So we've got that. We've got um, bay leaf tree there. Uh, we've got thyme there. In fact, we've got thyme in the trailer as well. We also have mint there. And... What's this called? Oh. Can't remember what it's called. It'll come to me. I'll put something on the caption. I'll put a caption up. I'll remember what it is in a minute. So, another beautiful day. On that note, I think uh, my compilation is done and um, we're going to chill out this afternoon and uh, watch a bit of MotoGP and um, think about what's happening next week. I know I'm here tomorrow so I might film some stuff tomorrow. Anyway, thanks for watching. Catch you later.